Hi everyone, Brendan from Toggle here. If your team uses Salesforce and you're looking for a better way to sync your Salesforce data with Toggle Track, this is the video for you. Using this integration, you'll be able to choose data from Salesforce to turn into projects, tasks, clients, and tags. You'll also be able to set up how these are named in Toggle Track. Just a quick note before we start. Right now, this integration is one way. That is, we sync the relevant data from Salesforce to Toggle Track but we don't send anything back to Salesforce. We know this is important to some people. So if you're one of these people, reach out and let us know. We'd love to hear from you. A few more housekeeping items before we get to the good part. The Salesforce integration is available on our Toggle Track premium plan. This plan is available with our free 30-day trial. Also, due to Salesforce limitations, you'll need a Salesforce enterprise or unlimited plan. All right, with that out of the way, let's get started it can be useful to add a new Toggle Track workspace to test out this integration. This lets you try out the integration without syncing potentially lots of unwanted data to your main workspace that you'll need to clean up later. So with Toggle Track open in a web browser, head over to your settings from the menu on the left and go to your integrations. Let's click here to enable Salesforce Sync and click the button to connect your Salesforce account. Salesforce will ask you to allow the connection and show some of the permissions that Toggle Track will have access to. For more information here, check out our privacy policy. Once you've authenticated, continue with the setup. All right, so let's add a connection. The first thing we need to decide is if this connection is for the whole workspace or for specific users or teams. What this means is that whatever is created in Toggle Track from your Salesforce data can be visible to your whole Toggle Track workspace or only some people. So if you have your whole organization in Toggle Track, but only want your sales and support teams to see projects and tasks from Salesforce, you can pick specific users slash teams here. For this example, we're going to set up a connection for the whole workspace. Next up, Here's where you choose what you want to sync from Salesforce to Toggle Track. Let's say you want to sync Salesforce accounts to Toggle Track as projects. We can add a link and pick the account object from Salesforce. When the integration brings in each account record, it needs to give it a unique name. Here, you can pick what fields the integration uses to name each project. Every project needs a unique name in Toggle Track. Same with tasks, tags, and clients. So make sure this will be unique or else we'll pause the integration and ask you what to do. In this case, looking at Salesforce, it makes sense to use the account name and the account number just in case to make sure it's unique. You can also rearrange these fields to change how the project will be named. So if you use this account as an example, in Toggle Track, the project will appear as the account name, Edge Communications, then the account number after it. Each field will be separated by a space. At this point, you can continue with the setup or add more links. You only need to link one Salesforce object to Toggle Track. Adding more is totally optional. In this case, we're going to add them all. So now that we've linked accounts to projects, we're able to link something from Salesforce to tasks. We needed to create the project link first because tasks live inside projects and we need to know what project to create tasks in. Let's go ahead and link opportunities to tasks. In our example Salesforce setup, opportunities are related to accounts via the account ID field. This field makes sure that each opportunity has a parent account. We show this relationship here. And if there is more than one field linking the two, you'll be able to pick which one to use. For opportunities, let's use the name and order number to name the incoming tasks. Again, just to make sure it's unique. Because we're creating a connection for the whole workspace, we can also create links for tags and clients. Clients and tags can't be restricted to certain users or teams in Toggle Track. So if you're creating a connection for only some people in your team, you won't be able to link Salesforce data here, but you can always create more than one connection. Let's go ahead and link Salesforce products to tags.
and Salesforce contacts to clients. At this stage, if you want to add another connection to bring in other data from Salesforce, you could do that here. I'm pretty happy with how this is looking though. So let's go to the next step. This step is much easier and we're almost there. Here, we're telling the integration what to do if it tries to sync data from Salesforce, but there's already an existing item in TogglePack with the same name. For example, if you have a project in TogglePack named Acme Inc, and the integration is trying to sync an account from Salesforce as a project also named Acme Inc, what should happen? If you pick option one, the integration will connect the two projects. You'll keep any existing data in TogglePack, and any future changes to the Salesforce records will be reflected in the project names. For example, if you change Edge Communications to Edge Communications Inc., this name will get updated automatically in TogglePack. This is the safest option. If you pick option two, the integration will archive the existing project and any tasks within it, and then create a new project. And with option three, the integration will skip over the data from Salesforce altogether, so nothing is synced and nothing is changed in the existing project. For more details about these options, check out our knowledge base article. In this case, I'm going to pick option one. When you've picked the option for how to handle your duplicates, it's time to preview the integration. Here, you can check out how you've set up the integration before syncing. Then once you finish the setup, the integration will begin syncing your Salesforce data. On behalf of the entire team here at TogglePack, we hope this new integration saves you some time. As always, if you need a hand with anything or have any feedback, reach out to our Rockstar support team.